A Portland City Councilor says she was the target of online harassment after speaking out against a sign last week. One which her fellow city councilors are calling an act of white supremacy. Now a protest against racism is set for this Friday. News Center Maine's Jack Molman has more. And I am exhausted that it's 2023 and we are still here having the same conversation. Monday evening's Portland City Council meeting had tears. And I struggled with whether or not to, but whether or not I would speak tonight. I kept thinking that if I do talk, um, then I'm adding more to this scenario that is already happening. And cheers of encouragement as Councillor Victoria Pelletier reports she's been harassed and attacked online over her statements against a banner posted in Portland on the first day of Black History Month. I shared the photo on my social media page and talked about how absolutely hurt and disappointed and harmed and disgusted I was, and so many others were because of that banner. The sign strewn from this light post here on the corner of Congress Street and High Street, arguably one of the busiest intersections in the entire state of Maine. The sign itself said it's okay to be white. Now everybody driving up High Street could see what the sign said, including all of us at the newsroom. So that's alarming, by the way. That's very alarming. University of Southern Maine lecturer Harlan Baker says since 2016, he's hosted anti-racism protests at Monument Square Park. But now, he is moving this Friday's protest to the location where the sign was. Because I think it's important to reclaim the space as an anti-racist space. Meantime, the threats made to Councillor Pelletier also come just a week after she and another councillor expressed resentment that the city of Portland and the Portland Police Department released a statement on the police killing of Tyree Nichols, an unarmed black man in Tennessee, without consulting black city councilors. The city did not reply to our request for comment. The city did put out a statement Tuesday where councilors called the poster back on February 1st, an act of white supremacy. I spoke with somebody from the University of Maine who works for the Center for Diversity and Inclusion who said that the sign being here on the first day of Black History Month was deliberate. And she also said that for centuries it's been okay to be white, but for those centuries it wasn't okay to be black. In Portland, Jack Mulma, New Center, Maine. And that protest against the poster is Friday afternoon at Congress Square Park. We tried to reach Councillor Pelletier for comment about those threats, but did not hear back.